Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. Today is Thursday, November 16th, and today we're going to talk about praying for the dead. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your sacred heart in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, friends, we know as Christians we are called to remember our beloved dead, especially in this month of November. Mother Church calls us to particularly remember our beloved dead. But what do we mean when we say remember our beloved dead? Here's what we don't mean. When we say remember our beloved dead, we don't mean, well, we're going to fall into some type of nostalgia that's going to lead us to empty emotion, that's going to keep us focused on ourselves. That's not what we're talking about. We talk about remembering our beloved dead as Christians. It means we remember them. And then immediately we begin to pray for them. Remembrance should lead to prayer. In the Christian faith. It means because when we pray, what we do is we are actually doing a real service to our loved ones. We are directing our attention not on ourselves, but to our loved ones. We're praying for them. That means we're giving them grace. God is allowing grace to come through our prayers and to be given for our loved ones. If they're in purgation, our prayers are helping them. In addition, when we pray for our beloved dead, we're getting out of ourselves, which means we're actually letting God's grace heal us and encourage us. So it's so important that when we begin to remember our beloved dead, that we allow those thoughts to immediately be turned into prayers and that we pray. This is our response as Christians. It's an act of kindness. It's an act of charity. It's an act of justice. It focuses our spiritual energies on our loved ones and not only on ourselves. And those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you to keep fighting the good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.